going live. We're going, going live. Hey, hello. Guess what? At Mackey's, but you can't see because it's got all the bit. Oh, yeah, you can. Look, Mackey's. Mackey's. Um, I like this new angle. It's good, isn't it? Um, yeah, welcome to uh, another exciting review of another Tex Max. First one in 2018, to be fair, uh, but they do bring them out every year. Um, Tex Max snack, uh, £4.19. and pennies. We're at Posh uh, um, Mackey's in uh, Wigan. In Wigan, the Posh one, the Wigan one. I put <laughs> safety first. Let me see belts on. I don't want to, I don't want to, you know. Hey up, Dan. You all right? So, Taste of America. Hey, it's great. Taste of America. I don't know what to gay. Well, I think you should gee something nice. Maybe ask for something and then see if you get something completely different like I did yesterday. Anyway, it's Tex Max. Tex Max. No, there's no need to be rude. Oh dear. There you go. So it's got. We know already, don't we? Really, it's got two burgers. It's one of which is slightly burnt. Tomato, lettuce, nachos, and uh, cheese. Uh, the meal. Well, it's the burger. It's just the burger, not the meal. Uh, and it's four four pounds and nineteen pennies from the posh McDonald's. McDonald's. So uh, the nachos are actually. Uh, look at the nachos. Look at them. They're actually proper full nachos and everything. That looks lovely. It does. You are talking about the burger, aren't you? And obviously not my new haircut, which is lovely as well. Yeah, obviously the burger. Uh, no fries. No, I, I I can't have too many KFC, uh, too many meals like this all the time. So oh, the, I don't like the bread on this though, because it's like, listen to this. It's like sandpaper. Sandpaper. Thank you, Dan. You've made me feel better. If I have to have the top of my head shaved off, I look like Phil Mitchell. Anyway, so that's it from the other side. It's the other side. Derek Okora. <laughs> so that's the most haunted joke. You won't get it if you're not British. <laughs> it's very funny, though. <laughs> the other side. Is there anybody there? No, just a piece of lettuce. Uh, well, quite a lot of lettuce and a tomato. And it looks like an onion as well. Yeah, that was onion. Right, then. I think the tower is lovely, I don't need to wish you luck. Oh no, it's your random one, isn't it? It's not always good. Hmm. It is dry, to be fair. It's also got, um, eight and late, being about. But look at the size of the burgers, they're quite, quite meaty. Obviously burgers are meaty, what the hell am I on about? Anyway, we're at McDonald's. It's in Wigan, UK, 2018, 1st of June. And these have been out for a couple of days. I forgot, to be fair. Sorry. Um, yeah, it's got the... Um, what's the sauce on it? I can't remember what the sauce is. But it's actually given a bit of a bite, is the sauce. I've got a bite back. Mmm. It might be a new haircut. It's not a new haircut, it's just a haircut. If I have this haircut all the time, I just let it grow out. And then I realised I was sweating like a pig. The problem is now I think I've got some type of line. Um, but anyway, I'll have to even that out, won't I? Mmm. I also hope it throws out the continuity of my next news report as well, the haircut. Because you know me, I don't like continuity. Right, uh, get back to this. The nachos are nice, they add a different texture to it. Uh, the burgers are very, very meaty. I mean, they are proper burgers, these. Mmm. Do 
which is a bit of crunch. Always put a lot of lettuce on as well. The bread's better than it sounded earlier. If you were, if you were here earlier, I did this. Um, well, it's a bit soggy now because I've, I've sweated on it. Just had a bit of rain as well, that's why my car steamed up. Live weather report. Yeah. New and joke on the uh, Tacky TV news thing. The tomato and the nachos. The sauce and the cheese really go well together. I mean, it's not a new concept. Oh, that was a long while ago. Um, the, um, the what's the call it? That was just in TV, that. Ooh. It's, uh, I think it's hot cheese because my mouth is on fire. This is actually probably my favourite one so far. It's proper meaty. It's got a bit of a zing to it, or a zang, whichever way you want to look at it. Zing zang. Um, I, can feel, I can feel hairs growing on my chest. It's that manly, because it's from Texas. Well, they're all men. I think I've probably got about three hours now. So, at least go and buy some of that shaving stuff, don't I, for bodies. Someone told me to do that, and I thought, well, that'd be a laugh, won't it? You want me to see any body hair, and I'll put it on, and then shave it off, and you won't be able to tell the difference. It's five pound well spent, not. Anyway, proper meaty. Proper taste. Let's see if it's a... I've I, I seen the sauce is getting me, but I don't know if it's a sauce, whether it's a cheese, but there's a bit of cheese there I might be able to lick off. If I'm lucky, you were. <laughs> no, because I'm lactose sensitive. <laughs> Sorry, I burped then. I wasn't getting emotional. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually lactose insensitive. So I... <coughs> I can't have it anymore. I can't have them. I can't have them. <sighs> milkshakes anymore because I'm lactose sensitive. Not intolerant. People are intolerant of me, but I'm not lactose intolerant. I'm just lactose sensitive, which is why I've just said that cheese and my mouth is on fire. So I think it's the cheese that's the hot thing. It's took me eight minutes to eat this so far. Stop talking to me. Mmm. So it's four pounds, four pound nineteen. Hello, Adam. You're new. Adam's new. Say hello to the new boy. Hello, Adam. He's new. He's new. Let's be nice to him. Don't scare him away like we do with the other ones. Yo, Batman's not here. You'll be all right. Anyway, four pound nineteen. Is that value for money? It is actually because you're getting. I mean, look at the, look at these burgers. They're proper burgers, um, and they are uh, meaty. I thought you thunder then. It's someone's music, and they got the bass on very loud. <laughs> um, very meaty. It's got different textures going on as well, so that's good. Chris, is there are there any more let's visits? Yeah, you put the uh, where's the hyphen? The hyphen's got to be after the letter T because it should be let's visit uh, with a hyphen. But I'll put the hyphen after the T of visit because that really knocks people off. And like I said before, I don't like continuity, so my brain works. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing a let's visit. I'm, I think I'm doing one for Wigan because I've got loads of ideas, but I might get kicked out of Wigan. And then where would I live? I'm definitely going to do one for London. I'm definitely doing one because I've got 1989 me in London. I've got 1989 me in... Um, that's better, yeah. Let's visit hyphen. Oh, you bought the Minecraft card game. Ah, 
So it's all right, he knows I'm insane, so we don't have to be nice to Adam anymore. He bought a Minecraft card game, for God's sake. Have you played the Minecraft card game? What if we play the Minecraft card game? We'll never know. Yeah, very enjoyable. Really? It's better than the game, though. <laughs> Filming for um, the next Let's Visits over the weekend. So see you, Dan Dan. Don't know where yet. I've got Wales in mind. Uh, but last time I was going to do it, it just rained in Wales. And I thought, I'm not going on a rainy day. I can't be asked. Uh, and what's the other one? Oh, and I've also got uh, Newcastle. Oh, I've never been to Newcastle. Uh, Wigan, where I live. And other exciting places. Yeah, that jumper was hideous, wasn't it? I like the campness as well. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Look, we're here. <laughs> like that, that was... Um, that's what old TV presenters were like in 1989, so I was acting. Hmm. Hello. <coughs> no, I was acting. Whew. I'm trying to get a job on Emmerdale, but I'll probably end up on Hollyoaks, to be fair. Anyway, oh, it would love to be a mass murder on Hollyoaks. That'd be great, wouldn't it? Just killing off all them bloody kids who would really do your head in. Not that they ever watch it, but you know what I mean. Right then, so it's gone. Gone. £4.19, uh, value for money. How much should I give it? I'll give it 8.5 out of 10, value for money. There's people actually watch this for the review, so I better review it. Um, what was the other thing? Oh yeah, let's hold this up so it'll... Um, so let me see, text, text back, so we'll do it like that. Do it like that. Right, hold it up there. And then that will just hopefully come up as the uh, thumbnail at some point. Uh, so what else is there? Value for money we've done. Taste. I'll give it 9 out of 10. It is a really, really, really good burger. Uh, so overall, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So you can't say fairer than that. Well, you can. You could give it 10 out of 10. But that wouldn't be fair. So to be fair, that's not fair. Anyway, someone else has left, so I've, I've scared someone else off. I think it was Adam. Whoever said something last, I think they said goodbye, and I didn't I didn't take them on, so I'm sorry. Ooh, I'm in trouble now. Um, but, yeah, the Let's Visits, uh, I like doing them. They're somewhat new, <laughs> although I started doing them in 1989. Uh, but they are new, and uh, pardon me. Um, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing more of those. Um, I'm going to get back on to Crackdown as well, because people are asking me to do Crackdown. Looking for the orbs, so I'll be doing that. Um, not that I eat a lot of uh, fast foods, by the way, but look, I've got a, I've still got my KFC cup from yesterday. I mean, that's embarrassing, isn't it? But the only reason I'm eating this today, after having a KFC yesterday, is because I forgot completely that the Tex-Mex was out. I thought it was out next week, not this week. So it's my fault for getting it wrong. But at least I ordered the right burger and didn't get one of them chicken ones again, because I've done two of them now. But I kind of wasted the uh, what I did yesterday at KFC, which was the um, the the original uh, what was it the original um, tower burger, but ended up with a zinger, the two hot wings on the hottest day of the year. I literally sweated like a pig, and then when I had a poop earlier on, there was sweet corn in it, and I thought, oh yeah, that brought me back to that. So I also had a drink of fire and a bit of sweet corn in my poo. But you didn't need to know that, did you, really? So we'll, we'll edit that bit out. Oh. It's live. Oh, fuck. Oh, well, no one's watching, so it's fine. No one will see that bit. So, for, yeah, 4.19. Uh, Tex-Mex, best one so far, as far as I'm concerned. I don't think the other one's got nine, but I never watch my reviews back, because, to be fair, my reviews are for the for strange people uh, to watch. And, you know, I mean, basically watching an old man in a car eat burgers. I'm going to do with Five Guys as well, but I need someone to give me the money for one of them. So if someone wants to give me the money for a Five Guys, why is there someone walking by my car? Oh, they've been to the bin. How very dare he? He walked on my shot. How very dare he? That's not right at all. 
shall get Boris Johnson onto this case immediately and get him to stop it. There's someone over there with a high-vis vest on as well. Look, high his jacket. Look, there he is. Oh, he's, he knew her. See, see how he hid then? He's like, shit, you've seen me. Right, I better arrive. I better go. Better hide. Hmm. Right, nice to see you again in more subs, by the way. Uh, try to like every video, get the video seen by more. Try sharing, that always works. You, do you always get noticed? I miss that. Do a bump. Do a bump if you're still there. I think there's all you left now. Everyone else is gone. I've scared them off. Just write, type the word bump and then press enter, obviously. Oh, can I do it this way? Hang on. All right, there we go. Do you get noticed at the takeaways for doing these location videos? Um, bump, thank you. Uh, no, but they know me now at... Well, obviously KFC have known me for a long while. Um, and Burger King now know me. Um, because when I ordered the, the big six stack... Uh, bacon King burger that was like that big, big as me head. Um, the guy come to me and said, "Oh, you doing another video, lad?" Yeah, lad. I mean, come on. I'm old enough to be your granddad, mate. Well, not your granddad. I mean, he's yeah. The, like, I'm old enough to be dad, mate, kind of thing. Oh, look, there he is. There he is. Look, he's pretending to get litter. That's good, isn't it? So throw some litter on the ground so he can come here and pick it up. No, no, I won't do that because I'm not a bad person. Well, not when it comes to throwing litter, anyway. Uh, so the other reason I've used it, uh, done it today as well. Hello, Kieran. Hugh. Hugh. I'm not in Wales yet, but we'll uh, we'll save that one for when I'm in Wales. Hugh. Yeah. Like that. I might do a, a live going over the Menai Bridge uh, onto Anglesey when it's a nice day. Uh, he's behind you. You got any work? The cleaner. Uh, not Kieran. I was going to say it wouldn't surprise me. Kieran was behind me, to be fair. Um, you got any work? Yeah, I've got loads of work. I've got loads of stuff to do. I've just put out stacks and stacks and stacks of uh, CDs and they were all um, a quid each. No, tw two, 20p each. Oh, what am I saying? I don't even know what I'm saying. CDs for 20p. Bargain. He's coming round. Oh, there he is. He's back coming back in shirt. There he is. Ooh. He's hiding behind the bin now. Where have you been? Where's Kieran gone? Kieran, you said who? And now you've gone? What's going on? Anyway, I'm also using my data up as well. That's another reason why I've done it today. Uh, because my data refreshes tomorrow and I'd like a gig of data left. So I thought, I've been a good boy. And that includes, to be fair, that drive I did from Wigan to the Humber Bridge. Which took quite a long while. And I streamed the whole thing live. For no apparent reason. With Mavis. Anyone remember Mavis? She was lovely. Oh, oh, remember when there used to be trucks on the motorway? Oh, remember motorways? Oh, remember when cars had wheels? That kind of thing. Um, so anyway, I'm waffling now, inanely. And this has nearly been on for 20 minutes. Oh, there's a car going through the drive through I'm going to stick up my finger. No, it doesn't work. Right, and I've absolutely messed it up now. I'm not thinking about it. So let's confuse everyone by doing a thumbnail of KFC. Like wistfully into the distance. Um, yeah, I mean, going back to my let's visit hyphen. Um, when are you live again? I'm hopefully in the morning when I wake up. If I wake up, I mean, I'd be, I'd be worried if I wasn't. Well, I wouldn't. Well, I wouldn't be because I'd be dead, so I wouldn't know. So, yeah. So hopefully I'll be live for you know at least at least another few weeks. Was that thunder? don't think so um see my brain's weird it doesn't work like normal people's brains so i do apologize chris you asked for a pretty straightforward question and i completely didn't answer it um when am i live i don't know normally when new burgers come out normally when i'm visiting my mama because I, I have a burger when i go to my mars and that's about the only time unless i'm going to a committee meeting so there's also them as well so it's usually around about seven o'clock well, about quarter to seven to half past seven, depending on what I'm doing, where I'm going. Um, but it won't be this week now. Although it might be, I might do. If I go out on Sunday, I might do a bit of live casting on Sunday. But it depends where I go and what I'm doing. Um, so we'll have to wait and see on that one. Um, but it's been very enjoyable this chat. I'm not even eating burger for five minutes, and we're still talking. And there's still two people watching. 
uh, Chris and A N Other, which is their name. I can see it, A N Other. So uh, which stands for Another, just in case you're not like really old and don't remember things in magazines. Oh, there's a car going past. What is it? It's a Mercedes. A Mercedes. Vroom, vroom, vroom. We're not at a siren either, have we? That's unusual. Hmm. I'll make sure to pop in like the stream. We'll share it now too. Hopefully you get a few more subs. Yeah, I'm desperate for subs. I think I'm on 355. Is it? 255. No, 355. And you need a thousand now. And my channel... It's got so much different variety of stuff on it that you think, well, it's, someone's got to look at it. 355, thank you. <laughs> someone's got to like it, haven't they? So uh, if, you, if you're still watching this video and it's not live, then A, you probably need to look at other streams. But B, subscribe, because you obviously like my weird humour. Well, some people just think it's weird. But either way, uh, we've got we have got up to three now and I've stopped eating the burger five minutes ago. Should I get, it? Should I get the wrapper out again? And no, I won't. But look, it's it's in there. It's now in my tummy. I'm digesting it, and I will poo it out tomorrow. I'll let you know how that goes. I'm not doing the live cast of that though. Don't worry. That would be interesting though, wouldn't it? Live cast of eating it, and a live cast of it coming out the other end. Mmm. Wonder where I put the camera. Mmm. You'd have to get the angle right, wouldn't you? Mmm. There's an image I didn't need. Anyway, McDonald's, Wigan, Posh One. Tell it's posh because it's got wood around it. Uh, best McDonald's that I've probably ever been to, to be fair. Uh, my previous best one was um, in Bolton. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. Bolton. Uh, that was my previous favourite. Uh, my previous favourite KFC was in Ashton on the line. Uh, oh, here comes the rain. Um, either that or the pigeons are pooing on me from a great height. Um, Ashton on the line was great. Um, and then we opened up one in Wigan, which was even better. -er. So uh, they're my two favourites. And my favourite Burger King, to be fair, is the one in Wigan. So I'm kind of lucky. If you like fast food, this is like turning into this bloody uh, let's visit, isn't it? If you like fast food and you want to live somewhere where they sell good fast food, come to Wigan. We haven't got a five, guys, but I wouldn't worry about that. And we have weather as well. Raindrops. Raindrops keep falling on me car. I can't think of anything that rhymes with car. Anyway, I'm going now. Everyone else is gone. So if you're still there, Chris, I will see you next time. Everyone else, thanks a lot. Please share these things. Sharing is best because more people see them and hopefully more people will sub. And if more people sub, then I get... No, I don't know what, I'll never make any money from it. But if I do, I'll be able to buy better things. Okay, thanks a lot, Chris. And uh, you take care and we will see you again next time on the tube of you. Unless, of course, I'm on the tube in London. In which case, you're still going to see me anyway. It would just be a different tube. Bye. And if I missed the button then. <laughs> I'll miss it again.